think a head project is important because it gives people control and it gives people choice. We have our own responsibility to sign up to this and be responsible for what happens to us in the future. The instinct for family members is often to prolong life, particularly if there's been a short illness, a traumatic event, so there, there is a tendency to want to instigate treatment at all costs, and that may not be what the patient would have wanted. The benefit for me signing up to this scheme is, should I ever be involved in a serious accident, for example, I don't want to be kept on life support if there's no way back. And I would like, at this stage of my life, to be able to put something in place that will remove the burden away from my family. I don't want my wife, or indeed my children, to have to make this hard decision of keeping me alive or letting me pass away. Well, we plan and think ahead for all kinds of life events, major and minor, holidays, weddings, births. But end-of-life care is something that many people tend to avoid thinking about until they have to. I think there are lots of care preferences which people could consider. I mean, one of them would be, for example, to have a think about how they feel about their quality of life vis-à-vis -vis their length of life. I can think of situations like people dying with cancer, whether or not they should have uh, chemotherapy or radiotherapy. If somebody was very, very ill, not going to recover, and very poor quality of life, a lot of suffering. And they might feel they want to say, thus far and no further. I have arrived in households and there has been conflict over maybe uh, do not resuscitate. And you can see the pain and the anguish within the family. It's a time of crisis. Everyone's feeling very vulnerable, very, very raw. Um, it's Ideally, they pull together, but it's not always like that. Families are very human. So I think something that's down there in black and white could, I think, save a huge amount of conflict, heartache and hassle. I certainly will be recommending the Think Ahead project to my patients. I see that it will mean that they will be getting the sort of care that they would have wished for and will be making what is undoubtedly a very difficult time for everyone that bit easier. There's one more item that the family don't have to um, deal with. I really don't want them to be thinking, you know, 10 years down the road, was it right, was it wrong? And that's why I think people have to make the move, you know, sign up to this scheme and, and basically help your family in the future.